Hello, people. It's Tuesday, and I'm Terry Time, and I'm going to do a little field trip and a little mutt bank. And it's a very special mutt bank because it is special for Dee and Tammy. Tammy has already tried the food and loves it, and Dee wants to try it. But she's told, she said she never can remember it when she's driving by a Sonic. Well, I guarantee you after today she'll remember it because I'm getting the dessert too, and it's fantastic. So I don't think there's going to be much to show you on this road trip unless something happened. Oh, but I do want to show you my new nails. I'm so excited about, oh, this phone. It's still haunted, people. It is still haunted. It's going to be jumping out at me. It's not going to stay put. Oh, no, now this truck wants to pull in, and I've got, god damn it. Fuck! You dumb fucker. Just go this way, then. Well, how's everybody doing? Good morning, Joey Dimes. I love your videos. They make me laugh. Good morning, Tammy, Sylvia, Dixie, Dee, Sly. I was so flattered that you played my video on your channel. I'm so flattered. Thank you, gals. I'm going to shake the pills for all my hillbillies and rednecks everywhere that I love. And a special shake for Dixie and Durkee. Oh, and I forgot. Sophie's a West Virginia gal, too. Okay, people. Tell me how you like this outfit. My dress, my hair, my dress and my glasses match because that's one thing I make sure I do. I like to match my glasses with my outfit. Now for these beautiful nails. Look at that. They're probably my favorite ones so far. There's my paw prints and my little K for my man. I love them. I love it. I just let my my uh, nail tech decide what she wants to do to me. I don't ever tell her. The only thing I want on there are the little paw prints. I hope this is right on red because guess what? I'm going right on red. And if I do show you anything out the window, I'm not going to roll my windows down because that wind was terrible in my last video that I tried to do. It was terrible. You're not going to get to see Hyena today because I don't like taking her with me in the car because I don't like leaving her in the car. And it's hot. It is, folks, 75 degrees here, and I am burning up. Burning up. really don't have much to talk about. Everything's been pretty calm. I heard some stuff shifting and moving around in the mob tubes. Some, some coalitions that are breaking down and some new ones that are being made, but I don't want really want to speak on them because it could all be rumors. But I kind of feel like there's going to be some changes coming in mob tubes. Of course, I don't hang in there much with you guys because I'm back with my patriots and my hillbillies and my fish people. So I, I catch Joey Dimes. Every time I see a notification, you better believe I'm in there watching his stuff. But the rest of you that have those long lives and 100 people on panel that won't show their face, I, I haven't got the time or the inclination to really find out what's going on. I hear things in the background. People tell me stuff. People send me stuff. So be ready for some shifts and changes. Because they're coming. 
Not that they're going to be that bad. I don't think they're going to be that bad. I'm kind of looking forward to them. Because my tube was getting to be a lot like the bottom feeders. Oh, and the bottom feeders have a new name. And I absolutely love it. And I know none of you are going to like the person that gave them this name. But it doesn't matter. It is a good name. He called them Old Skanks. The Johnny Mac and Code and Muscle were hanging out with some old skanks. And I actually like that. I gave them the name Bottom Faders, and I think it's only fitting that Tony Pizza should give them the name Skanks. I love it. Something new, something fresh, from somebody that's done everything and met everybody. What more could you ask for? So Bottom Faders, you are now called the Old Skanks. Love it. Me included, even though I'm not in there anymore, I'm going to take it. I'm going to take it like I, like I love it. I've been called a lot worse than a skank. A whole lot worse. Hope you like this little muck bank I'm going to do. I hope you notice that glittery stuff in my hair. She put some, I don't know what it's called. I hope you can see it. It's like glittery like Icicles like you put on a Christmas tree and a damn phone. Oh, it's getting on my nerves so bad. I'm about to take it out and just let you see the scenery. I don't want to get caught with this phone because this road right here is a damn cop trap. There's cops everywhere and they catch me talking into this phone when I'm supposed to be paying attention to the road. After I show you this, D, the next time you talk, you better have told me you tried this stuff out. You guys have already seen those broccoli tater top things that I love. I'm getting an order of them, but there is a dessert that is better than sex. Better than sex, people. I'm going to get that dessert, too. It is so fucking good. If you can get to a Sonic, believe me get there because these are specials these don't they don't have them all the time they only have those broccoli things once a year and i've never seen them have this dessert before i don't know how long it's going to last and i don't even eat sweet stuff because you know i order my unsweet route 44 tea with my vitamins i don't eat sweet stuff but this dessert oh my god i swear it's better than sex way better. Oh, and I got the little initial on my fingernail, the little K for Kevin. I don't know which way it shows. That's for Kevin. Because he had to call me while I was in the beauty shop, and he requested that my nail tech put his initial on my nail, so she did. So I got a K on there. We're getting along. It's super fantastic. Haven't had to ghost him one time for three days. That's all. But I'm, I'm used to the prison. I don't know what's the matter with this. God, I'm burning up. No wonder I didn't have the air on. Hot. 75 degrees. My roses are still blooming like you can't believe it. And I haven't paid any attention to the skanks, to the old skanks, their new name. I haven't been paying no attention to them. I've got a few clips, but I guess who knows what they're doing. I don't care. I'm so glad to be out of that. I'm so glad. Durkee got home from jail. He was home for Thanksgiving. He shared it on Facebook. I got to see my Dirk. His mother cooked food. Fantastic food. Yesterday, Sunday, I went and seen my friend Ray. And if you have watched my videos very long, you've seen him on my videos. He's been on a bunch of them with me. He's got some bad news, but I'm not going to talk about it. Doesn't have nothing to do with prison. He's out of prison. It's a hell of a news. But anyway, I don't really want to talk about it. And I've been going to see him on the weekends, but he hasn't been in any mood to get on, do any, any of this stupid YouTube stuff with me. He's got more on his mind. I think my fucking hair is gorgeous. God damn, I think my beautician might be a magician. She put these little, I don't know if you can see them, these little, like, stuff you decorate your Christmas tree with. She put that in my hair. So 
icicle looking things and my nail tech took orders right from my man over the phone to put a K on my fingernails. She did that. Believe me, I take care of the rest of myself by myself. I don't have people taking care of every part of my body. It's my head. And you've seen me looking pretty damn rough. You've seen me looking pretty skanky. Because I don't really give a fuck sometimes when I'm at home with them dogs. I don't care if I got my Larissa beautiful filter or if I don't. I'll go out there raw and uncut. You've seen it. And I'm not going to be able to wear my Trump hat today because I don't have it in the car. But Trump. 2024. We need you, buddy. This goddamn country's just about gone, but like I said, it won't really affect me because I got money, so I don't care. But it's bad for the rest of you. And I watched a horse racing documentary about Ruffian. I'd seen it before, so it got me all upset and sad before I left the house this morning. Because you know how I love animals. And my little pistol dog, his dad, called me He's going to be leaving pretty soon, so that's going to be sad. So i got to get him back on here again. I've got to get Hyena on here again because Dee and Sly and Tammy and Sylvia, they all like the little blessings that she does. So I'm going to get her on here. I'm not going to get her on here all. Uh -oh, we got road work people, but guess what? I'm going to get them fine triple the speed because I just went right through there like there wasn't a flag man in sight. Oh, God damn, it's hot. 75. I'm telling how hot it's going to get today. I'm going to try not to cuss too much. But, if any of you live near a Sonic, after you see this mud bank and this food review, promise you will at least try it because this fucking I mean the tater the broccoli top things are out of this world but this dessert that I'm going to get and I'm going to show you unparalleled in any kind of dessert I've ever eaten oh my god it's so good and I'm so sick of this damn phone abracadabra I'm a hain not a witch but I want to see if I can get the spell off of that phone because I'm sick of it Abracadabra. Leave, spirit. Come into me. Leave my phone flowing free. Well, I shouldn't have said that, but I was trying to make it rhyme. The phone's pretty much free. It jumps all over the place. Whatever it feels, I hope you can hear me. Because I lose signal up on this part of town. Man, it's dreary looking today. It looks like rain. I'm not getting a drop of rain on my hair, people. Not one drop. Got to groom some dogs today. Four going to do this mutt bank for you guys. Then I'm going to get off of here and go do my dog grooming. And then I'm going to go home and relax. And that rose bush has more blossoms on it. I couldn't believe it. The little one with the orange that one does. My Queen Elizabeth bush. I've never seen anything like it in my life. And here it is. I don't know what date it is. Who knows? But I know it's November think it is. might be December, but it shouldn't be rose season. I'll tell you that. Oh, and my phone went off in that beauty shop, and it plays that Black Betty, and I mean, it was playing it loud all over that shop. Nobody said a word. I love that song. I don't care what anybody else thinks of it or not. It might be my favorite song next to the Hollies, Long Cool woman in a black dress. And I like that Black Betty song, too. Oh, Black Betty, bam, 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 I love it. It's been my ringtone ever since I've had a cell phone. That is my signature ringtone. And then for special people that call me, they have their own ringtones. Who plays Black Betty is just my regular one, but now that I got that puppy, I had to give that owner a special ringtone. I forget what I gave It's 5 o'clock somewhere, I think, or something like that. Oh, and Joey Dimes, I heard a little rumor that you were... God damn this phone. That little goddamn demon Exeter didn't work. I heard a rumor, Joey Dimes, that you work for the FBI, that everybody I'm up to was an FBI guy. FBI, I love you. Federal 
Bird Bureau of Intoxication. Ain't that what that means? That's what one of my drunk husbands used to call it. He had a shirt that said FBI on it, and then underneath it said Federal Bureau of Intoxication. And he would wear it to his parole classes that he had to go to make him quit drinking. That was a joke. That was a joke. And he was my best looking one, too. Number six was my best looking husband. God, he was so good looking. He was in a band, motorcycle mechanic. Never been married before. I was his first. He was my number six. Man, he was an alcoholic out of this world. Vodka alcoholic. So we finally, finally got rid of him. And I bought the place I live in now. Because Texas is kind of fucked up. If you get married and some guy stays with you, even if it's your house, they can get part of the money out of the house because they lived there and did some repairs or something, but he didn't try none of that. I had him served while he was in jail with divorce papers. He was sitting in the jail when he got those divorce papers. Then he got he got arrested, I think, for another DWI. I don't remember, but he wound up going to Georgia and his mother had passed away and left him a beautiful ranch in Georgia. Beautiful. And he was a Navy guy, so he, the Veterans Hospital, took care of his, tried to get him off alcohol a million times. When he went to Georgia, he had a stroke, a real bad stroke. So now when he calls me, it's pathetic. He remembers how to say my name, and that's about it. Now that would be horrible, to have a stroke, and the only thing you can remember is my name and me. I would hope he had some better memories than that. We had couple good years, but I don't last with anybody over six years. And the six-year mark gets there, them fuckers got to move on. Oh, and my stepson came and saw me. That was fun. I don't see my guy walking that I always talk to either. I think it's going to rain today, people. I've just been rambling about it. story time. I want to tell you the story about number six. So anyway, he had this stroke. Well, his brother, his younger brother, Corey, called me and said, Dan is in the VFA, v Veterans Hospital, VA Hospital, and he's asking for you, and you're the only word he can pronounce. So I called up there to the VA. Well, they told me he had a stroke and he couldn't answer the phone. Well, they didn't even take it in there to him. I don't know what they thought they were going to do with it, but I talked to him after he got back. But he's so hard to talk to, I can barely understand him. And he keeps asking me, am I coming? I'm like, I've never told him I'm coming. He lives in Waycross, Georgia. I'm not going there. Been there, done that. Didn't show me nothing then. Ain't going to show me now. I feel bad about him, but it's not my responsibility. He drank himself. You know, I hope he doesn't pass away. But he barely can call me because he can I don't know if it's his right side or his left side that's paralyzed. But anyway, he has to have his brother dial the phone. And then half the time when we talk, I have to get his brother to tell me what he's saying or tell him what I'm saying. So it's sad. And he was a lot younger than me. He was about 15 years younger than me. But this dude in the prison is 30 years younger than me. Maybe more. Maybe he's 32 or 33 years younger. I'm supposed to be getting some new pictures of him. I'm going to try for that love after lockup shit. I don't care. I ain't in it for the love anyway. I've been in love twice and it sucked both times. The rest of them were just collateral damage type dudes. I'm in Grand Saline now. We're soon going to be doing this lovely food review at the Sonic in Grand Saline, Texas, where I live with my dogs that are not abused ever. They're well treated. They're as well treated as you could possibly treat an animal. Here I go. I'm gonna park in one of the little stall things so I can talk to you guys while I hold it so damn good. Hope they have it up there so I can remember what to call it. Okay. Where is it? They better not have got rid of them. I'm so mad at them. I'm going to have to drive through because I don't see them on here. I'm going to do the drive through so I can see them and make sure they got them. 
Sonic people. I was going to go to a different place, but I'm, a, I'm addicted to these damn broccoli things, and I know they're not going to last. And Whataburger got rid of that real good burger that I like. So I figured we'd just do it again. If you're sick of it, you're just going to be sick of it. Oh, yeah, they still got them. Oh, I can't wait. I want those cookie dough bites and a large order of the broccoli cheddar tots and a Route 44 unsweet tea with extra ice. Unsweet. cookie dough bites. I didn't know you could get large ones. No, it's just a regular okay, bite. then that's that's what I want. Alrighty, that be it? Yep. Alrighty, that be a little bit Thank you. Oh, people, this is so good. I don't know where I'm going to go eat this now. I don't want to go up by my house because them dogs will know I'm out there and they'll go crazy. And I've got to do some stuff before I go home. I might go down here to this little park. I've never been there with you guys. So I can show you that. It's just like a baseball park thing. One well, of my boyfriend's up here in the window, I think. I don't know if it's the one I like or not. But he's a good one anyway. I'll replace him. He'll be a replacement guy. Hey, I hope you're watching this and taking this down because you need to try it. Oh, I love my nails. I love them. I think they're my favorites. I love my hair. Glasses, I like my dress, I love my dogs. Everything's good. Come on! Don't take me long to twist off, people. I can get mad just as quick as I can get glad. What are they doing? Ordering a whole goddamn thing? I like to have somebody when I do these say, hmm, I can see that glitter in my hair. I don't know if you people can or not, but I see it. That's looking, looking jazzed. I love it. Oh, I love it. I tried to talk her out of it, too. Well, I didn't. It looks like a carload of damn kids, too. Probably take them forever. Probably take them 20 minutes just to get the drinks out. play some music, but I don't want to get struck with a music strike. 
and I sure can't sing anything to you. I'm done with the story of number six. Well, not quite, because he played in this band. When I met him, he worked at this shop in Arlington called Two Wheel World. He's a motorcycle mechanic. But he took aeronautics in the Navy. He was on a nuclear sub. Sharpshooter. He had marksmanships, trophies. Good looking. Oh my God, he was good looking. And I went to a going back to jail party for this biker dude I know. Because they give parties to him when they get out of jail, and they give them parties when they go into jail. And he was playing the drums. And I knew the lead singer in the band. His wife is my friend, Shelly, today. And I knew the red-haired guy in the guitar, but I didn't know the drummer, which was Dan, which would be my number six eventually. So I was getting bored with being there because I'm not much of a drinker. And so the girl that was with me, she was already flirting with the dude that was going back to jail. So I said, well, if I don't pick somebody out of here, I'm not staying. You're going to have to get a ride or ride with me because I'm getting ready to leave. This is boring. About the time I said that, the band took a break. And the drummer came right over to me, Dan, and he said, If I'm still seeing you in a year, I'm going to marry you. You're going to be my first wife. And I said, Okay, that's the deal. Well, I'll just say anything get along. So we went to the Red Roof Inn. The guy that Kathy was with was married. She didn't know it. So his wife's calling everybody, trying to find us all night. She never did find us. But anyway, I never thought I would see the dude again. So I... I think it was a couple weeks, and he called me, and I went to Arlington, and I went to the motorcycle place where he worked, and I won a free T-shirt, like I always do, by having a wet T-shirt. If you showed your breast, you got a free shirt, so fuck, I did it. I got the shirt. And so I'm doing something. I was still working at the salt mine, and my daughter called me, and she said, Mom, there's some guy here from Arlington that just pulled in. It was him, and he never left. He stayed that day that he drove here. Good. Finally, I can get the food. Get out of here. Oh, wow. This is ridiculous. No, I don't know this kid. Sweet, I hope. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Feel like it's got extra ice in it. <sighs> Damn it. Fucking rookie. It ain't got extra ice. It's practically all melted. God damn it. I like extra ice. Listen to that. When it rattles like that, it don't have extra ice. At least it's unsweet. I put my vitamins in there and I'll like it. I guarantee you. I have to get my drinks at the Sonic because it's the only drink that goes with my vitamins. My high speed chicken feed. Real good. I can't quit looking at my nails. I love them. I think this is my favorite time she's ever done. Damn it. This is the slowest it's ever been. does not have extra ice. Period. Listen. I like my eyes packed in there where you can't even hear it. They either got a slow cook or a slow worker, one or the other. This is going to be a terrible, terrible mud bank because I'm already getting mad and I'm all the fuck. The shit better be hot when I get it. The tea ain't right. Rattling, rattling, rolling. Okay, 
folks. That kid's pressing his luck with me. Okay, look at this. Mm. Broccoli tops. D, go get them. Tammy, I know you got them. You told me you did. We're going to go to this little park. Oh, God, them things are good. Wait till you see them. Oh, back, Betty, bam, bam. Oh, back, Betty, bam, bam. Back, Betty, had a child. Bam, bam, the damn thing gone wild. What's going on? Oh. That's my dessert. Where's my damn dressing? It was about a half wet. I bet he didn't even put any in there. Damn it. Bunch of damn mustard and shit. What the hell am I going to do with that? He did not put a bit of ranch in here for those things. Mm, they're still good even without it. I'm going to wait till I get up here where I can look for that. I got dressing at home, but I don't want to go home because I'll get my dogs all stirred up. It's not time for me to go home yet. <laughs> yummy, yummy. Get you some, D. But I can't describe to you how good it is. But it is so good. He didn't put the ranch in there, people. You're gonna have to eat them without no ranch on them. These are good and fresh and hot, though. Mmm. Mm -hmm. Will I stop the BFW people? They just got one here. This town was dry when I moved here. You had to go to the bootleggers to buy beer. Or drive 32 miles. Okay, this is a little park. Better not be anybody here. I don't want nobody fucking with me. Oh, it looks pretty empty. I don't know where the damn little tables went. Fuck! Just got to sit in the car and eat, I guess. I don't see no tables. They used to have a little picnic table down here. Inside the thing, but I'm not going in it. Okay, here we are. Park without even a table, it's way up there. I'm not gonna mess with it. They put ketchup. Look at this, people. Put ketchup. No, uh, lots of napkins, but no damn, no damn ranch. Gave me enough condiments to feed everybody in mob tube twice. Don't look like they gave me very much of my dessert either. Three little things. Oh, this is pissing me off. Doesn't matter by the minute. Anyway, I'm going to eat these little desserts. You know, I only got three. Damn, I ought to go back up there and just raise fucking hell. Got my ice creams melting. Oh, these freaks. Okay, the dessert, you dip it in the ice cream. All three of them. Mmm. Chocolate chips. A chocolate chip donut hole. And you dip it in the ice cream. Oh my God, it's so good. Look at it. Mmm, mmm, mmm. God, it's so good. Even though I'm mad at that little fucking punk.
Oh, great. Broke off in my ice cream. I guess you only get three of these things. If I can't find the other ones in there with all that ketchup and mustard. Look. Mmm. So good. This actually gives the broccoli tots a run for its money. Let's go get this stuff. Make sure you haven't got a team of rookies getting it for you. Mm. I have a spoon or nothing. I'm going to end this. D. Tammy. Dixie. Sylvia. Joy Dimes, try this if you got a Sonic. Make sure you don't get a rookie. Get people that know what they're doing. Because I am pissed. Never seen nothing like this in my life. When the hell am I supposed to use that ketchup and mustard on how am I supposed to eat this ice cream with three dessert deals? <sighs> I'm going to turn this off. I'm in too bad of a mood. Hope you enjoyed this little mukbang. Even though it was fucked up. My tea hasn't got extra ice in it. But the food is delicious. Service from one to five is minus one. Food five. I will catch you guys later.